So our next guest says that uh, the team will have its work cut out when uh, it comes to improving America's image in the world of business. We're joined now by Alison Stewart-Allen. She's the uh, Director of International Marketing Partners and the author of the book, Working with Americans. Alison, it's great to see you again. Thank you, you There's too. no doubt that uh, the brand America has taken something of a battering in recent years throughout the, the Bush presidency. I mean, can, can the brand be revived? Can the, can the sparkle be, be put back on the, on the sign? Well, I think it's already started, funnily enough. The fact that, in a way, we've appointed uh, a new chief marketing officer uh, in the form of this new president uh, automatically is sending a mandate to him uh, to actually fix the brand. Change, thankfully, is the strap line. It's the key word of his administration. It's the ticket in which he was uh, got in. Uh, but really there's a few key things that he'll need to focus on in terms of getting the package mm. if you apply marketing principles to this getting that package absolutely right like what then i mean right. tell us what, what's, in, okay. what's in the package well typically uh in the world of marketing we tweak the four p's as we call it the yeah. pricing the product the promotion and the place so if you talk about the pricing of our of doing business with americans one of the issues that gets factored in is the hassle factor so it is a hassle very often when you work with when you go to america from outside in terms of getting in at the airport, the way you're treated when you're queuing, you're in very long queues very yep. often, and it's a pain. Yeah, Britain and it's has, put a, has a similar problem. <clears throat> and it's put a lot of people off. So you, one of the things you would certainly change there is make it less of a hassle to get into America, to even do business with us on our own turf. So that's one of the issues under price. Then you have the product idea. And one of the aspects about the product that needs to be fixed is clearly with the Wall Street meltdown of the last uh, few weeks, uh, our sort of style and brand of capitalism isn't necessarily uh, one that the rest of the world wants to model anymore. So it seems totally unregulated. It seems out of control. Bonuses seem out of control from the perception of the ordinary uh, non-American, I guess, and maybe even American too. So get actually the way we regulate financial markets, the way banks operate, the way bonuses are paid is another fix. Then you have promotion, the third of the four P's. And the reason promotion is critically important is because if you think about all of our embassies, all of our uh, ambassadors, they in effect are a form of marketing organization to get the message about American trade and business out there, mm. but also they need to be supported better. I mean, it's for the last several years, that uh, uh, department of state has been deeply underfunded. So you have uh, people who are very willing, but maybe need a lot more staff, a lot more training. They need the messages so that they can be effective marketers, yep. basically. And finally? The final one is place, which is where you encounter America, the distribution channel. Mm -hmm. So the embassies are a distribution channel, but also distribution channels in a way are American companies themselves. And because there's been a, a definitely a dampened appetite, to be polite, yeah. uh, in terms of people wanting to work with Americans, we need to actually get these distributors of the American way of doing business, uh, but also their openness to making money yeah. out there in the marketplace it, more. It, it all sounds pretty, pretty obvious. Hmm. Uh, you know, th this is this should be high on his priority list. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, but he's got an economy to fix. He first, does. Hasn't he? I mean, he does. So and, and in a way, if you fi but once you fix certain aspects of the economy, some of these other things fall into place, like the product. Yeah. So how we actually regulate our financial markets, short selling, for example, bonuses, for example, then we actually start to fix that product part of the marketing mix. As, 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 a, as, a, as, a, as a marketer, as, as someone in, in the business, I mean, what's the worst thing he could do? I mean, a lot of people, a lot of Republicans are saying that, oh, we're, we're entering an era of isolationism, mm, if you like, from yes. Barack but he's going to shut the doors and make it much more Absolutely, and that is the worst thing that he could do, mm -hmm. is erect uh, protectionist barriers that tells the rest of the world, hey, actually, we're not interested in doing business with you. We're very safe and cozy here in our own 48 contiguous states. Yeah. Go away. I don't imagine he would do that. He's a very bright person. He's getting good advice. Yeah. I think he'll, uh, he'll, he'll do fine. Yeah, let's hope so. Yeah. Alison Stewart. Alan, many thanks indeed. Great to see you again. You too. Thank you.